We've already engaged with the Public Prosecution Service to make sure that people can have confidence and feel safe in coming and cooperating with the police investigation. So there is that piece of the cooperation with the police investigation to bring those responsible to justice. And as police officers, of course, that is important to us. But there is also something about narrowing the ground that these people uh, walk on. There is something about the unity of purpose that we see right across civic leadership, political leadership, all of the main political parties standing together in condemnation of this murder, of this violence against the communities of Derry and right across Northern Ireland. And I hope as a citizen as well as a, a chief constable that that opportunity will not be lost. And we just heard Father McGill in his reflections piece in the funeral service talking about the responsibility on our political leaders to step up and to take advantage of these tragic circumstances where the life of Lyra at 29 years was so horribly cut short. So I hope our political leaders will do just that. I hope that people will continue to stand with the police, to cooperate with the police. We've had over 140 people come forward and provide video footage and witness accounts. We need more of that. We believe that this death, uh, this murder is absolutely solvable and we want to bring that degree of closure and criminal justice outcome to it as well as police officers.